know the law. I do try to abide by the law. Does that does the sun feel good, Bonnie? Without any further ado, drum roll please. That was also terrible. Um, I'm gonna tell you where I'm gonna be and hopefully some of y'all will be there. y'all welcome back it is um it's starting to rain which is not very welcome right now <laughs> so this video I'm gonna be I'm gonna be getting going some seeding doing some seeding trying to get done with some seeding not getting as much done as we hoped with some seeding I believe <laughs> anyway I appreciate y'all being here if you like the channel subscribe please. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Also, stay tuned. At the end of the video, I am going to share some exciting news and a possibility to meet up. Yes. So, you got to watch to hear all about it and see where and how and when. Elmo update. <laughs> Still growing. Still wagging, still drinking. He said breakfast is his favorite. Well, then lunch, then supper. Right, buddy? <laughs> Cutie tootie. Bonnie, where are you going? Oh, okay, pay attention, Mom. Blowing smoke this morning, huh, girls? <laughs> hey, Panda. You're all by yourself. Are you ready for breakfast? <laughs> Bulls. <gasps> heifers. Hungry heifers. I see you, girl. Oh, yeah, I didn't see that though. <laughs> we gotta come back through here, y'all, just, just for a second. You got something on your mouth. Or your nose. When you get a text that says, come help me, you have no clue what that means. Oh. Assuming it might have something to do with the seed. Nope, nope. Something to do with the sprayer. It's telling me to stop. Um, the beams on the sprayer don't fold. Oh, we just had a time trying to get them up over around the pole. Anyway, that wasn't PG either. Now we're just shuffling some things around. He's trying, he's trying to get in the field. He's trying to get in the field and get this barley planted. And it's just, uh, it's one of those things, like I've said a million times before, you gotta do 8,000 things to get one thing done. I'm trying to pay attention and see if I'm needed. I may be. So he needs to move this. He's gonna to try to pick it up on the pallet, which means I have to help guide the forks. <laughs> which doesn't always go very well. <laughs> so here's hoping as I fall in a hole. Okay. Like zip ties, duct tape and stuff, chains. 
Yep, that works. Well, I mean, so far, so good. <sighs> yep, I know what we're doing now. We're moving, we're moving things so we can get to the cedar. Now, where to put it? <laughs> we're, it's a little crowded up here, a little crowded. <sighs> To have so much land and yet nowhere to put anything. It's weird. Alright. She worked. The zuki has actually been starting a lot better. I asked him if he did something and he said no. <laughs> so, I guess it just it feels better. Alright. Now... Now he's gonna back in here, get hooked up. I can't stand up today. Get hooked up and hopefully get rolling. We have, what, what's today, Wednesday? It's supposed to rain again, I think, Friday night, so we've got three days, which should do it. <laughs> Knock on wood. Yeah, woo! A little bit. Guess what time it is. Yep. Grease time. You've been a bad dog messing with cows. I know. He said he's a cow dog, he's supposed to. Yeah, yeah. Go lay in a mud puddle. I know you want to. Oh. Guys? I can't, I just can't be still. I just can't be still. It's too tempting, mommy. It's too tempting. You hear they're talking to me. They're telling me they want me to come back. No, they're not. They're saying stay away, black and white doggy. I know you were right there in the middle of it, Bonnie. Gus? Having a hard time. If you're new here, don't tell me that he needs a electric gun. Cause he doesn't want one. There's something oddly satisfying about watching that grease squirt out. Or maybe it's just me. When the children can't behave, they have to go be put in timeout. So they're going to be put in timeout. <laughs> okay, baby's delivered. Baby's delivered to the house where they cannot chase cows. Shoo! I mean, they were giving them a fit, and those mamas were getting mad. <laughs> it's really a pretty day, though, y'all. See it? Every day good when you get to see it. Some days are just prettier than others. Halfway full first round. Now we do the tractor truck shuffle. You know, I don't have to put my seatbelt on because I'm in my driveway. 
couple of y'all get really offended when I'm not wearing my seatbelt, but guess what? I wear my seatbelt on the road. I know the law. I do know the law. I do try to abide by the law. I try really hard. Um, anyway, <laughs> I digress. Okay, he's going to fuel up the tractor. We're gonna take it to the field and come back and get another truck. So we'll have a truck down there. Then I gotta go to town and get milk. Milk for the calf, milk for the family. We're out of milk. What? Uh, and then get back in time to fill the hopper up again. I call it a hopper. Hopper? Cedar? Seed hopper? I think it fits. It's windy. Whatever. On the hunt for a cedar. A little bumpy. I'm down here in the river bottom. I mean, I'm almost 100% sure I knew where he was, but maybe I wasn't listening correctly because I'm almost at the end and there is no farmer or cedar in sight. Whoops. <laughs> I'm definitely, I'm definitely not in the right place. I'm going to hear it about this one. Yes, I is. I could have swore he was down here. Oh, well. I'll keep looking. I mean, I'm pretty sure this field is getting planted. Um, yeah. Oh, my gosh, y'all. I missed him. This was in the very beginning. I drove half a mile <laughs> okay anyway I found him it's all good maybe he didn't see me go to the other end maybe and actually get the seed. Forgot about that. Have seed, will travel. See what I did there? Once again, the sun is setting. Oh my gosh, it just seems to get earlier and earlier. I might be able to finish this field today and then move on to the big one tomorrow. That's what we're hoping anyway. All right, let's unload. Ho! Oh. So this is a field, that field back there, uh, that we had pearl millet in that we cut for hay this summer. So now we're planting barley and we will cut it for hay come spring. As long as the Dan doesn't get it. The Dan, the river. It's what we refer to it as because that's its name. to see some deer down here. Somebody asked why I never show any deer. Well, I just don't happen to get them on camera. We have them. Oh, true story. Last week we were checking cows and a doe and a buck came out in a field and um, I did record it. Well, I thought I recorded it, but I actually didn't hit, hit record until I was done and put my phone in my pocket. So, 
that that didn't work very well. <laughs> I'll keep trying. And since I'm sitting here in my truck again, <laughs> well, my truck this time, time, not the not the old farm truck. I will just say really quick, a little bit more truck chat. Not nearly as long as the last video, but I just want to say thank you. A lot of y'all have really, <laughs> you've really humbled me with your response, humbled me with your responses to the last video and some of the things I chatted about. So, um, thank you. I really, really, really do love this YouTube family that we have here. That's how I consider it. Consider it a family. We're sharing all of our family and, and all we're doing with you and um, your responses and your comments and your encouragement and your support and your stories. You sharing your stories with me. I love it. So that's all. That's all I'm going to say. I don't even think I'm going to get emotional today. Yeah. How about that? A vlog without tears. Yeah. Novel idea. <laughs> Well, he finished that field, so we're moving on to the next. That's good. Sun hadn't even set yet. <laughs> Not quite. Just right though. She's put put putter in this morning. <laughs> a little, a little chilly, isn't it, Bonnie? Everybody, good morning. Let's do this thing. Oh, <laughs> oh back of battery. Then one crank this morning. Does that did the sun feel good, Bonnie? I'm sorry. I'm not going to disturb you. And now we wait. On a silage wagon. It's a rough life in a Bonnie. I know. But not near as rough as this truck. So we're on to day two of seeding. And I was wrong. I can't remember if I said it. Did I say that we were going to finish probably? No. Mm -mm. If I said that, I was wrong. We're hopefully going to finish the seeds that have been ripped and prepped. But there's more... Um, the fields need more coffee. There's um, more fields that need to be prepped. So we won't get those done before the rain comes. They're calling for nine tenths. We don't need nine tenths. Maybe nine tenths of a tenth would be okay. Is that a thing? It is now. Anyway, so that's what we're doing today. The kids are actually going on a field trip. I'm, I'm not. I'm letting them go letting them go with other people. I've been on this field trip before. It's amazing. Appomattox, Virginia. It's very much historical. It's a historical site where there was, it's where the Civil War, I think it ended there. I mean, it was signed. Something to that effect. Anyway, they're heading there with other homeschool kids. I'm going to come back here and help do things. <laughs> And take care of some Meredith business that she needs to take care of. So it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood and um, we'll see what it holds. Dessert. Oh, it's muddy. Who didn't wear their muck boots? Me. The original boot scraper. 
<laughs> it's not perfect, but it'll do in a pinch. Morning girls, you have uh, dessert now. You have dessert. Yeah. <laughs> More seed. Well, the last of the seed, actually. Pretty sure. Best help. He needs to turn it around. So, he's gonna put it down, come in from the other direction, and I'm gonna try to help. Curious cows. <laughs> what are y'all doing? Doing this. Got it. Woohoo! Supervisor over there. <laughs> All right. square body. Am I right? If you don't agree, well, we'll just have to agree to disagree. Loaded up. Loaded for bear. Well, something like that. Let me finish this field. That's good. get a truck well we thought it was not gonna start raining until tonight <laughs> wrong it was raining this morning when we woke up it's supposed to rain more around lunch then it's really supposed to rain all day tomorrow <laughs> oh so it goes We're trying to give everybody a turn to do something. Bonnie goes with me to feed Elmo. Clara goes to feed the calves. Gus gets to go with his daddy to check the first, or well, to check the cows. Try to play it fair. So we don't have three dogs all up in here at the same time. I think Clara is pretty happy right now, aren't you, girl? <laughs> yes, mommy, I'm very happy. She sleeps. And looky, looky, it's starting to rain again. Yeah, that's how I feel too, Bonnie. I was really hoping it was going to hold off and at least let us get, get fed up. Now we're just going to be fed up. So I did it. Well, this is classic. Did y'all know this about me? I share it on Instagram a lot, but anyway, I have issues with gas. <laughs> that sounded bad. I have issues keeping gas in my truck. Anyway, um, yeah, I've been trying to do better, but hopefully I can make it to the field where he's at and then to the gas station. I see signs of ripping. That's good. Just gonna keep going until the rain came. Maybe he'll get it done. This is not a field we own, it's a field we lease well we trade we'll say that we trade some work on this farm 
to be able to use it. So, that works. Turning it red. This ground was really in bad shape. <laughs> really compacted after all the rain last year and just needs needed some work before we can get anything else to grow again. So, there you have it. doing that he's gonna keep ripping until he can't rip no more <laughs> oh gosh that sounded silly too um anyway yeah it sure doesn't look good it sure looks like rain's coming so hopefully he can get done tonight before it gets here now without any further ado drum roll please that was also terrible um I'm gonna tell you where I'm gonna be and hopefully some of y'all will be there. So, I have been asked by Farmers Business Network to attend and speak at their upcoming Farmer to Farmer Conference in Omaha, Nebraska. Yay! I'm so excited. I've never been to Nebraska and I hear December is a beautiful time to visit, right? <laughs> I'm saying that a little tongue-in-cheek, but I'm super excited to be going to this conference and this event, and I'm going to get to speak with, wait for it, Zach Johnson. Maybe you've heard of him, this guy out in, this millennial that farms out in Minnesota, <laughs> and I'm also going to be up there with Nick Welker from Welker Farms and Ryan from How Farms Work, and Tony Fast from Fast Ag Montana, another YouTube channel. So, we're going to be chatting all things YouTube, <laughs> and it's going to be moderated by Jay Hill, who's a large farmer out in Texas, and um, I don't think he says it that way, but anyway, it's going to be fun. I'm super excited. I hope I hope I get to see some of y'all there. So if you're going to be able to go, definitely let me know in the comments. And um, yeah, it's going to be a good time. All right, that's it. That's it for now. We'll see. We'll see what's next. Not really sure. Other than trying to get more seeding done and hoping it doesn't rain a whole lot. <laughs> next week is Thanksgiving. Yeah, my favorite. I love Thanksgiving. All right, until next time, farm hard, live well. Buy a hoodie. I got a few left on my site. <laughs> and I've also restocked t-shirts. And I'm gonna have merch available in Omaha. And I'm gonna be rolling out a new shirt out there. So, a new design. All right, all the more reason to go. All right, take care y'all. I'm gonna stop talking. <laughs> I cut myself off. I said I'm gonna stop talking now. So, officially, I'm gonna stop talking now. <laughs>